All right, what's up, y'all? Welcome back. It's me, Jose Alfredo Lara. Today is Monday, January 17th, right? 2022 of the Gregorian calendar. It's the energy of the moon, Luna, right? Archangel Gabriel, Orisha's um, Elegua, right? So this video is going to be tarot tales for the water elements, right? The water signs, Cancer, Scorpion, Pisces. So let's get into this. All right, water signs. So I'm going to get you three cards in matters of family, in matters of career, and in matters of love, okay? So for Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces, in matters of family, in matters of career, right? For family, we have Scorpio, the animal, which means there's a transformation that's going to take place, right? And you should dive deep into it. Don't be afraid of it. Go with it. So in the family career life, you have a transformation happening. It's going to manifest for you, okay? In matters of career, for Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces, right? In matters of career, it says Pisces the mystic. Ooh, dive deep into your emotions. You have lots of water signs, Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces, and we have Scorpio and Pisces popping up here. Come on, look at that, right? So definitely in matters of career, right? It's definitely a time for you to tap in to your imagination, right? And your emotional well-being and creativity, okay? In matters of love for Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. What do we have for love in matters of love for this week, right? For Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. When it comes to the matter of love. Libra, the idealist. Okay, so in matters of love, you want to remember always to bring in that balance right, in all your connections, especially the love connection that you may have for someone, right, and this is love, so it could be the love for yourself, the love for um, family members, the love for friends, and the love for a partner, remember to bring in harmony and balance, okay, with that Libra energy, right, make sure you have an awareness to do things just and right and fair, all right, so let's get This tarot going, it's very fitting. All right, so for Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces, right? When it comes to the home, hmm, Page of Swords, very interesting, with Libra energy. That popped up over there, so we're taking it as that, okay? When it comes to matter of love, there's something that, there's a new understanding that you're going to gain, right, with this Page of Swords, right? It's like you're going to learn something new, a new way to communicate, right, mentally, and how you feel and how you express your emotions. I heard it, so that's what it is. It matters of family for Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. Four of Wands. You're going to feel complete. You're going to feel stable. You're going to feel, right, like everything is just right with this Four of Wands when it comes to the matter of the home and the family, okay? This transformation is going to be bringing in something new to you, more stability, okay? So for some of you, this change could be manifesting a new home for you, right? Either new location or a new energy in the home. All right, and now in matters of work, right? Your, your career, work and career for Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. Five, four, three, two, one. In matters of career, right? And work. For Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. What do we have for Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces? In the matters, oh, the lovers, a decision, <laughs> a choice to make, right? When it comes to the matters of work and career, right? This is choosing wisely. With that lover's card, with the Gemini energy, right? This is choosing to really be more, well, Gemini is the energy of social, right? They're like the social butterfly. But it's definitely making a choice and a decision in love, right? For some of you, like choosing, like to do something in your career that you're truly passionate and you truly love, okay? Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. And now we're going to get a confirmation, okay? For each one of these. There we go. Seven of Pentacles. Be patient. Everything will manifest in due time, okay? With the Seven of Pentacles. Keep nurturing, right? All your dreams, all your aspirations, because they will manifest in time. All right. Confirmation for Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. 
Eight of Wands is going to be coming very quickly. So you will have to make a choice because within eight hours or eight days, right, you're going to see something coming into your life, like a new opportunity. And you're going to have to decide, right, is this something I'm truly passionate about and something I will truly be happy to live with the choice that I make. All right. And final card for Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces in matters of love. Ooh. Page of Swords to the Ten of Swords, which means it's time to put away, right? Put an ending to all those ways of thinking and feeling when it comes to matters of love because there's a new understanding, right, of love that you have gained or will gain, right? And it's going to propel you to move forward with this information and utilize it, right? Ten is an ending. Something new is going to come that's going to put an ending to your way of, of feeling, right? This uncertainty when it comes to matters of love, all right? For some of you, when it comes to matters of, of career and family, definitely there's a positive change coming your way, all right? Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. So that is your collective message for today. Get ready because I'm going to give you a bonus card message in the short. Love you. Peace, love, and justice.